All right, hey, Josh here, Attica Lumber, actually out here in Crawford County. But let's check this one out right here, 40 by 48, 16 feet tall. Trusses are getting set right here. But let's talk about, I haven't talked about this in a while here, but when we dig down, we go down 54 inches. You can see we set this three ply laminated column. And then what we do is we backfill this with 411 stone. You see that sandy mix? I almost call it like a highway berm mix versus obviously you don't want to backfill with dirt. Reason is you want the water to aerate and not uh, stick to the post. All right. And you can see a two by 10 treated skirt board, baseboard right there. And I had a young person ask me, not a young person, but I had somebody ask me, will that rot? And I tell you, 40, 50 years ago, we got a lot of callbacks as far as the post rotting, but treatment procedures have really improved and so forth. So uh, we have not had, really, we haven't had issues with this. So treatment's pretty doggone good. And you can see what we're using right here. We're using a three ply laminated column. Again, 30% stronger than a six by six. And again, a southern yellow ply, southern yellow ply, two by six, blue laminated, finger jointed together. You can see a pressure point there pressure point there and then also pressure point right there as well now let's talk about actually the trusses that we got set up right here you can see the trusses four foot on center now we're a four foot on center truss spacing cus or co company and the reason why we do that we think you know you know if you do an eight foot nine foot ten foot eleven foot twelve foot spacing trusses Think about it, four foot on center, you have one more truss. Plus, you can probably see right there, the purlins are actually flat. So, these builders, as they're setting this up, you probably could hear them right there. They're walking on flat purlins versus on edge. Now, if you set your trusses wider, eight foot, nine foot, you're gonna have some issues as far as, uh, you know, board cracking or something like that. And also, when you ply the metal, think about it. When you're plying, you know, purlins that are flat, um, you have a greater likelihood of those screws hitting the wood against the metal versus on edge. So that's what we're doing there. So just a couple things I wanted to share with you there. So we'll keep you up to date on this building as we progress. But 40 by 48, 16 feet tall, post green building under construction here, nice setting in rural Crawford County, Ohio. So, all right. So comments are always welcome. I know it's a short video here, but look at the site, pretty nice site here. Comments, always welcome. So next one, keep it locked over here. Attic Lumber, Attic Lumber since 1925.